In the vast prehistoric landscapes of what is now Queensland, Australia, a unique predator roamed the dense forests and open plains. Australovenator wintonensis, a name that might sound imposing, was one of the most intriguing dinosaurs to be discovered on the Australian continent. This medium-sized theropod, often nicknamed the cheetah of its time, has captivated the imagination of paleontologists and dinosaur enthusiasts alike since its first discovery in the early 21st century. But what exactly was Australovenator, and what makes it so special in the world of paleontology? The story of Australovenator begins with a groundbreaking discovery in the heart of Queensland, Australia. In 2006, a team of paleontologists unearthed a remarkable fossil site near the small town of Winton. This site, known as the Matilda site, was rich in fossils from the early Cretaceous period, a time when dinosaurs dominated the land. Among the many fossils found there were the remains of a new and exciting theropod dinosaur, which would later be named Australovenator wintonensis. In 2009, after extensive study and analysis, the fossil was officially described and named a genus name, Australovenator, and it's derived from Australis, meaning southern, and Venator, which is Latin for hunter. The species name, Wintonensis, pays homage to the town of Winton, where the fossil was first discovered. This naming not only reflects the dinosaur's geographical origins, but also its role as a predator in the ancient ecosystems of Australia. The fossils of Australovenator are among the most complete theropod remains ever discovered in Australia. The fossilised bones include a partial skeleton with elements of the skull, teeth, limbs and vertebrae. This level of preservation has allowed scientists to study the dinosaur's anatomy in great detail, providing valuable insights into its physical characteristics, behaviour and ecological role. One of the most significant aspects of the Australovenator discovery is its contribution to our understanding of theropod diversity in the Southern Hemisphere. Before the discovery of Australovenator, the fossil record of theropods in Australia was sparse, making it difficult for paleontologists to piece together a comprehensive picture of these predators. Australovenator helped to fill this gap, revealing that Australia was home to a unique and diverse group of theropod dinosaurs during the early Cretaceous period. At first glance, Australovenator might appear similar to other theropods like Velociraptor or Allosaurus, but it had its own distinct features that set it apart. Measuring approximately 6 metres or 20 feet in length and weighing between 500 and 1000 kilograms, which is 1100 to 2200 pounds, Australovenator was a medium sized predator. However, it was not its size that made it remarkable, but rather its build and agility. Australovenator was designed for speed and precision. Its body was lightweight and streamlined, with a narrow elongated skull that housed sharp serrated teeth. These teeth were perfect for slicing through the flesh of its prey, indicating that Australovenator was a carnivore, likely hunting smaller dinosaurs and other animals that inhabited the region. The limbs of Australovenator were another key feature. Its forelimbs were particularly well developed, with three large curved claws on each hand. These claws were not just for show, they were powerful tools for grasping and holding onto prey. The hind limbs were long and muscular, built for rapid movement and enabling the dinosaur to chase down its prey with incredible speed. In fact, Australovenator is often compared to the modern day cheetah due to its potential for high speed pursuits. The tail of Australovenator was long and flexible, serving as a counterbalance during fast runs and sharp turns. This tail would have been crucial in maintaining stability and agility while navigating the varied terrain of Cretaceous Australia, from dense forests to open plains. During the early Cretaceous period, around 100 million years ago, Australia was part of the supercontinent Gondwana, which also included present-day South America, Africa, Antarctica and India. The climate was warmer and more humid than it is today, with lush forests, rivers and coastal environments providing a rich habitat for a variety of plant and animal life. Australovenator lived in a region that was teeming with diverse species, both herbivorous and carnivorous. The discovery of Australovenator fossils alongside those of other dinosaurs, such as Diamantinosaurus, a large sauropod, and Wintonotitan, another sauropod, suggests that this area was a hotspot of dinosaur activity. Herbivorous dinosaurs like Mudabarosaurus roamed the landscape, feeding on the abundant vegetation. These dinosaurs would have been potential prey for Australovenator, though its exact hunting strategies remain a subject of scientific speculation. The presence of sauropods in the area also raises interesting questions about the interaction between these giant herbivores and the more agile Australovenator. One of the most fascinating aspects of Australovenator is its place within the theropod family tree. Based on anatomical features, Australovenator is classified as a member of Megaraptoridae, 
a group of theropod dinosaurs characterised by their elongated claws and agile build. Megaraptorids are relatively rare in the fossil record, and Australovenator is one of the best preserved examples from this group. The discovery of Australovenator has provided paleontologists with new information about the evolution and distribution of Megaraptorids. It suggests that these dinosaurs were more widespread than previously thought, with representatives in both South America and Australia. This has led to new hypotheses about the migration and adaptation of theropod dinosaurs during the Cretaceous period. The discovery and study of Australovenator have offered a unique glimpse into the ancient world of Cretaceous Australia. This dinosaur was more than just a predator, it was a key player in its ecosystem, contributing to the balance of life in a vibrant and dynamic environment. Through the fossilised remains of Australovenator, scientists have been able to reconstruct not only the physical appearance of this dinosaur, but also its behaviours, interactions and role within its ecosystem. Each fossil tells a story, and the bones of Australovenator have revealed a chapter in the history of life on Earth that was previously unknown. Since its discovery, Australovenator has gained popularity in both scientific circles and popular culture. It has been featured in documentaries, exhibits and educational programs, helping to raise awareness of Australia's rich paleontological heritage. The town of Winton, where Australovenator was discovered, has embraced its role in this discovery with the dinosaur becoming a symbol of the region's prehistoric past. For paleontologists, Australovenator represents an exciting opportunity to explore the evolution of theropod dinosaurs in the Southern Hemisphere. Each new discovery related to Australovenator adds another piece to the puzzle of Australia's ancient ecosystems, contributing to a broader understanding of how dinosaurs lived and evolved in this beautiful continent. Australovenator wintonensis is more than just a name in the fossil record, it is a window into a time when dinosaurs ruled the Earth, and Australia was home to some of the most unique and specialised predators of the era. From its discovery in the dusty outback of Queensland, to its place in the larger story of dinosaur evolution, Australovenator continues to captivate and inspire those who seek to understand the ancient past of Australia. Thanks for watching.